Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to connect your computer to your Wi-Fi router through Ethernet and a spare router. If you have a spare router running around, you connect it through the Ethernet to your computer and to your Wi-Fi router. My computer is about two and a half meters away from my Wi-Fi router, so I need to find something to connect it because my Wi-Fi adapter got broken somehow and we just found a way to do this experiment with it and it actually worked. I think you should try it out too. This is my spare, this is my cable, one of my Ethernet cables and this is my old router, it's a talk talk router. You have to connect it to the power or else it's just never going to work. So you connect this to one side of the router and you put it in and it works there and then you I'm gonna connect this side as this is shorter and this is better to use from here because you also have to be aware of how for, how long it is I'm going to plug that into my computer right there so I've established that connection I can see my two lights but until you finally connect it there's no point that Ethernet being shown so we're going to get our next cable because this cable is not going to reach there and that power cable is not going to go far enough anyways so we get our second one and we just put that in the another one and you heard that click so we're going to go all the way with this cable to the other to the real wi-fi router seeing whether it's longer so i've come to the back of my real router and i'm going to plug that in right there and you can see the lights which means the connection is established you may see lights as well on the other side on your computer or something but not all the time will it be there i'm going to now show you why this is working so i'm going to open the settings up and i'm going to go to network and internet and you can say you and it says you're connected to the internet and if you go to available networks, you'll see that your, not your real connection, it won't show your real connection. It will show a different connection, but it's still the, your real connection being used. So let's now browse the internet. And it has come up perfectly so you can search anything on the internet like for example Khan Academy you can search up anything you want on the internet just like normal and it will just come out so that's how to do it Pause. so you don't really need to buy another Wi-Fi adapter if your Wi-Fi adapter got lost or is broken or not working anymore and you don't need to throw your old router in the bin because it's useful. Don't forget to like if you like the video and share so more people get to know this information and subscribe. See ya!